Where a jury is now deliberating in the murder trial of John Honore. He's accused in the brutal carjacking and dragging death of Linda Fricky last year. Yeah, the case went to the jury about an hour ago in the trial that started this morning. Chris Welty is live from criminal court. Lee May, yes, the verdict could be reached at any moment. Now, we're told that the jury has come back and asked the judge for written directions, wanting or written definitions, asking for definition of second degree murder, manslaughter, and negligent homicide. The judge did provide the jurors with those definitions with no objection from the state or the defense. Now, today was a very emotional day for the Fricky family and John Honore's family. In the courtroom, prosecutors said this trial would be quick. The district attorney's office outlining graphic details to the jury. The DA's office says in March 2022, John Honore, along with three accomplices, approached Linda Fricky's car on Bienville Street. After a failed attempt due to passing cars, a masked Honore pepper sprayed and dragged Fricky out of her car, stomped her, and beat her before she was dragged over 700 feet. Fricky's arm was severed, and prosecutors say she was skinned alive, the state calling the act merciless. We want to make sure that we get what Linda deserves, and that's the ultimate justice. Honore's DNA allegedly was found on an earbud collected from Fricky's vehicle. The defense admitted John Honore committed the crime, but says he was young and immature. Honore's attorney says he has remorse and referenced a letter he wrote to the Frickies. In that letter, Honore apologizes and calls what happened that day, quote, the biggest mistake of my life. Honore says he now prays daily and asks for forgiveness. Honore's mother testified that she went to police and identified her son after a photo of him was broadcasted on the news. She said she feels bad knowing he could receive a life sentence. Meanwhile, Honore's father was removed after an outburst. That I'm standing behind my son and he did nothing and he's innocent. The jury saw video of the carjacking and video piecing together the path after she was dragged. They also saw graphic photos of the incident. In closing arguments, the state said, quote, this isn't a situation of kids being kids as the defense would have you to believe. This is about a series of decisions that all led to the end of Linda Fricky's life. This is the killing of a human being. The defense said, quote, you honor Miss Linda by not sending him away for the rest of his life. Really, I'm just asking for mercy for a child and his mother. Now, John Honore did not take the stand in his defense. Once again, the jury is still deliberating at this time. Our Maddie Kurth is in the courtroom. So should a verdict come down, we'll bring that to you right here on Fox 8. Reporting live at Criminal Court, Chris Welty, Fox 8, Local First. All right, Chris.